Okay, this is orientation 97, lesson 3, in your PDF for the Beehive Brain Box Learning System. Um, it says review the cards in your deck and advance what you know. So let's start with that. We have cards behind uh, number 4, and so we're going to do that. Um, we're going to bring out number 5 in our deck and put the 5 down on the table. And then we will turn the rest of the deck upside down with its face on the table. Um, and we will uh, look at the cards behind number five. Well, that's A and A, and we know those. Then we will put number four upside down. And what do we know? We know the, okay. That was the only card behind uh, three, so now it goes behind four. We're going to put three down, and what are the cards behind three? And, we know that, and the other card behind three is of, we know that. Now we're going to put a two down, and we have cards behind number one. The cards for today are in and two, so you're going to want to write those on cards and then go through the deck and um, and, and learn these. Remember, two, in, two, in, two, two, in, two, in. Okay. When you know these, if you think you know them, they go behind number one. Now remember, the next time you go through this deck, you may be advancing cards. Um, to <clears throat> other positions, and you're going to put your deck back. Okay, three, four, five. Then you turn it all up, right up again. Now, what happens when you get cards behind weeklies? Let's suppose that um, our A and A now that are behind five, you have been able to advance them behind the weekly card. And this is up here to remind you of some hash marks. They look like slanted ones. Okay? When you have your cards behind weekly, you can put up here, as you see as I have done on the A, there are four little hash marks. Every week you put one of those hash marks on here if you know it and the card stays in weekly for four weeks. Okay, the fifth week you can put it behind I know these. You can put the cards behind I know these. But wait four weeks and then they can go behind I know these. Um, when you get to I know these we have a chart which tells you what part of the month that you should do your cards. For example, we suggest you do your language arts and math on the first week of the month, on the Friday of the first week of the month, that you do your social science or history and science on the second week of the month, that you do uh, your uh, health and music maybe on the fourth day of the month and on the uh, the third day of the month, rather, and on the fourth day, do your religion and whatever else you may be studying, so that you get a um, reviewing them once a month. If at any time, folks, any time, guys, any time, that you cannot recognize or answer a card correctly, even if it's behind I Know These or the Weekly, it goes back behind number one. Just remember that. It's a very simple system. If you know the information, the card advances one space. From one to two to three to four to five to weekly, stays there for four weeks, then to I know these, which you do once a month. At any time you don't know a card, back behind number one. It's a tremendous, tremendous review when you come to a, a test. You don't have to worry about so many tests when you're younger, but as you advanced through your um, 
your schooling and your and the different levels you will find that you have more and more tests and the Beehive Brain Box learning system cards can really help you to know your stuff. Well that's the lesson for uh, 97 and I'll see you in the next one.